What do you think of the Toronto Raptors? Let's talk just generalities when it comes to their club because they're 20 up, 5 down, best record in the NBA. Uh, Your outside perspective. Okay, what I said in the beginning of the year, uh, before the season even started, this summer, the moment they acquired Kawhi Leonard and Danny Green, I thought they were the best team in the East. I said that then, and so many people called in and called me crazy. And the reason I said that is because you look at the team that they had a year ago, Mm-hmm. Obviously, they lost their coach, but they were the best team in the East record-wise, and they got better. They got, mo- they got more talent, they got more experience, and they got more defense. Now they have a championship pedigree attached to that roster, which is already a good roster before Kawhi Leonard and Danny Green were a part of it because you still had Kyle Lowry. You, know, you still had uh, Serge Ibaka. You still had the best bench in the league. You still have balance units. You still have a heck of a team. Um, Siakam, all these other guys that are really, really, really good basketball players. And now you add in two excellent perimeter defenders, two champions, guys that have won a championship and have experience under their belt. You not only were good a year ago, but you got better. You got better. And now what you have in Toronto is a place where your roles are solidified. So everybody knows what's after them. That was my issue with Boston. They were going to have issues getting um, Kyrie Irving back and getting Gordon Hayward back. Because if you're Rozier and if you're Jalen Brown, if you're Jason Tatum, last year you were in first class. Now you're back to coach. And you know, no one likes going from first class to coach. Nope. So now Kyrie Irving and Gordon Hayward and those other guys are now in first class. So Boston is going to have issues with roles. What are guys' roles with egos and all these other things that are going on? And Toronto can just hit the ground running. 